What's up tennis fans? I'm Richard Pagliaro and this is Tennis Now, your source for the latest tennis news now. Well, Brooklyn took over Broadway in a big way last night as Late Show host David Letterman unveiled the billboard size 2010 Sports Illustrated swimsuit cover overlooking Broadway in New York City. The coveted cover went to Brooklyn Decker, Andy Roddick's wife, in her fifth SI swimsuit appearance. Brooklyn said her mom cried at the news and Andy posted on his Twitter page he was both proud and excited of his wife. Tennis and the SI swimsuit issue have a long history and they continue that with this year's issue. Anna Ivanovic appears uh, in a pool of pink tennis balls wearing a pink bathing suit. You don't want to miss that. Anna joins past tennis stars Maria Kirilenko, Maria Sharapova, Serena Williams, Steffi Graf, Tatiana Golovin, and Tommy Haas, who appeared with his girlfriend as SI swimsuit participants, so you want to look for that. And if you don't have the SI issue, check out a video on TennisNow.com of Anna's shoot for SI. Also last night in San Jose, Pete Sampras coming back for an exhibition appearance playing Fernando Verdasco. The world number 11 Verdasco took Sampras out 6-3, 7-6. Sampras did show some flashes, especially on serve. He had uh, nine aces altogether, including back-to-back -back aces in the opening game of the second set. Said he felt a little tired out there, but he looked sharp at times. Just the movement was a little bit of an issue. Interestingly, after... The match, Verdasco, if you remember, he trains in Vegas frequently with uh, Gil Reyes, Darren Cahill, and occasionally with Andre Agassi. And you remember Agassi's book, Open, last fall released, he kind of took Sampras to task a little bit for being dull. Also implied Sampras is a little tight when it comes to tipping. Pete said they have spoken and everything's fine, not a big deal. So that's good news for the Pete Andre future uh, exhibition series we've been hearing about as well. So that's it for now. For Tennis Now, I'm Richard Pagliaro, and we'll speak to you soon.